Hey guys, what's up? Kazumi here for yet another video and welcome back to the road to Paper Mario 3DS Part 2 episode number 6 this time. I was about to say Part 6. <laughs> Anyways, in the previous episode we got to Petalmitos for uh, the hunt for the first uh, Crystal Star. We looked at a gigantic um, uh, dragon flying to a, a castle. We uh, we got ourselves a nice uh, chill out badge, a close call badge, and we did a more uh, things including star pieces in the end shit. And in this episode, I'm going to be opening with a battle that is going to give us our first level up in the game. So that is pretty cool. With only two Paragoombas, you can imagine how, you know, how easy this battle is going to be. Which is uh, going to be really, really easy because now it's done. <laughs> oh, that was a nice uh, and easy way to level up. So uh, with that in mind, let's go ahead and see what happens when you get 100 star pieces. I mean, star points. <laughs> uh, level up. So pretty much it's the same thing as the same uh, uh, as the first Paper Mario. We're going to have uh, HP, FP, BP, and uh, right here I would like to. I mean, I, I am not that scared about you know enemies and shit. So I'm going to first go for my FP, then I'm going to choose uh, BP, and finally it's going to go uh, HP, FP, BP. So our uh, ooh a pipe. Now let's see. Okay, let's go ahead and fight these uh, this guy. Which uh, hopefully there are. Okay, so it's going to be a really really quick battle because there's only two of these guys, and we're going to be able to uh, one hit KO both of them. Oh damn it! Uh, one thing I forgot to mention is that um the the stage has an um like for example in the in the previous episode you saw that uh, the the background of the stage fell. So that that is going to to uh, uh, cause some damage to both us and the enemy. So uh, if we hit this um, this uh, thingy uh, a lot of times, we are going to get a lot of coins. Get out of here, and uh, I mean get down here. And there is a badge that whatever you do, you're not going to be able to get. So let's go ahead and uh, you know pass over here. Oh, one more thing, Mario. If you ever find yourself like uh, wondering what to do. Just press X and use my tattle ability, okay? I might be able to look up some useful uh, info that will help us in our adventure. So that's just going to tell us that, uh, you know, just uh, yeah, do uh, press X whenever you're lost. But uh, fortunately, I've played this game many times before and it's not going to be uh, anything to worry about. So um, I am actually wor more worried about the fire flower guy. So I'm going to go ahead and finish him off. Although the uh, Spike Goomba is going to cause some damage to... Oh, damn it. I, I should have attacked with Mario first because, uh, yeah, would have wouldn't have been, like, uh, you know, pretty cool. So, uh, Goombella is going to take one damage. Not the best thing in the world, but now this guy is done because we are going to uh, give him a little taste of our uh, hammer. Pretty cool. And that battle is done. Right there up in the, in the top right corner, you see that there are two mushrooms. Whenever I get the chance to uh, show this to you guys, I'm going to explain it. Oh, another fire flower. Cool. But uh, right now, it really doesn't have anything. Uh, right here, we have a, a bush that is, you know, going to reveal a pipe. And we're going to go uh, through it to uh, go in the uh, background. So, uh, pretty cool. If we hit it. A bridge is going to appear more, uh, you know, more like the very first Paper Mario in the first chapter, where you hit a switch and a nice uh, bridge, uh, you know, appeared. So uh, you could go back actually, but you would uh, you would miss on something, which is another star piece hidden in the background over here. I, I I really love how they included this in the game that you can go into the background and you know find uh, all sorts of things, but uh, actually. I'm, I, I don't actually remember if there's anything in the other side. No, there's not. Okay, so uh, less time for us uh, to, to explore the unexplored. <laughs> I really don't know what I'm saying at this point. So uh, now let me see. If, if, if we check this bush, we get a mystery. If we hit this uh, this thing, we get yet another fire. Jeez, how many fire flowers do we have right now? We have three fire flowers, two mushrooms, one life room. Man, talk about overkill. But uh, how about we enter this place? Welcome to Petalburg, the uh, the uh, uh, <clears throat> the land of Koopas or whatever, <laughs> the town of Koopas. Welcome, travelers. Huh? Uh, where are you? Uh, where are you? Uh, you ask why? Uh, this is Petalburg. Sorry, but it's been a long time since we have visitors here. We're kind of remote. Uh, yippity! Once uh, that dragon hooktail was spotted flying around this area. Well, it didn't help tourism, but uh, <laughs> put it. Put it that way. Fuck my uh, 
uh, my reading skills are not that great in the morning, so uh, people just stop visiting. Dragon? Hooktail? That must have been the, that, that huge thing we saw earlier, Mario. I don't do that. Ahem. So that's called Hooktail, huh? Ooh, scary name. <laughs> so anyway, Green Boots, have you ever heard of these things called Crystal uh, Stars? We're on this quest to, uh, for them. It's very important. Crystal Stars, you say? Um, nope, can't say that I have. Sorry about that. You might want to speak with the mayor, though. He's old. Really, really old. As such, he knows all kinds of stuff we don't. <laughs> we don't. Koopas of his age are, um, really smart. Anyway, the mayor lives in the pink house up ahead. You should go check it out. A pink house? Sounds totally hideous, but... Eh, it should be easy to find. Thanks for your help. So, you're free to roam around in the... Uh, no, I, I really don't. Uh, this is the, um... Petal bub or whatever from the first paper of Mario, so that's pretty cool. And right here we have a cool looking bear. Let's see what he has to say. Ah, bonjour, mademoiselle. It is a beautiful day, no? No, 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 not you, Monsieur Moustache. I'm speaking to the lovely little cabbage behind you. What do you say, my pretty? Abonnant is dollar and come away with moi? Ew, are you kidding me? Ew, nice wig. Uh, a wig, you disco wannabe. Take a hike, bust of the dork. Oh ho oh, oh, ho, sacre bleu, such a brutal honesty, such a sharp tongue. Well, I retreat for now. If you send your mind, Sherry, come find me. What a total sleaze. Let's go somewhere else, Mario. Okay, so, uh, you know, that cool French uh, speaking uh, bear, uh, you know, adds a nice addition to the game. How about we visit the store right here to get find a mushroom, uh, Mr. Softener. Uh, Fire flower is eight coins, not the best thing in the world. But uh, how about now we... Uh, here, I, I do believe uh, this is another in. Uh, oh, a white bomb. That looks interesting. So, uh, let's go ahead and change the screens right here. And, uh, well, another area of pedal. Oh, right there we see a badge. Let me uh, let me try to, to grab it. Eh, no, okay, it looks like we can't. <laughs> uh, how about we explore a couple of more things. And this, you know... Hmm, I think the best thing to do uh, right now is to go visit the mayor, which is in this pink house. Oh, it's an old Koopa, and you know what that means. <clears throat> um, was that someone there? Who's it? Who? What do you want from me? I know, you're thieves. Here to rob a defenseless old Koopa. Despicable. Marge is going to freak out. Go on, do what you will, but as you can plainly see, there's nothing to steal here. Oh, I guess I have a little money. Take it, you finks. And my antique shell, too. Just leave the photos of me and my man, the Missy. Can't do without those memories. What? No thief, you say? Well, what a story, then. Oh, wait, you folks looking for crystal stars? Well, why didn't you pipe it for? You idiot. Uh, we're just wasting time here. The crystal stars you say you're hunting? Um, wait, what did I hear about those dang things again? Aha, uh -huh, got it. Hooktail. Hooktail's got what you're looking for. <coughs> it's this enormous, extraordinary dragon to each folks, they say. You know Hooktail, right? Ah, uh, of course. Well, this Hooktail brutal flyby is necking to have a lost in pins and needles. So, are you buckler fools? I mean, are you gallant heroes after rough it up? You got it. This does sound promising. Uh, why you find rid of us, Hooktail, who shower you with gratitude and rewards? Wait, why did I hear you'll accept no reward? Of course. What a use, uh, useless man. You're noble indeed. Yep, a good egg. Now, why'd you say your name was again? Murphy. Um, that's a fine name. Yes, a fine name indeed. Now, Murphy. Uh, it's Mario. I appreciate that, Murphy. They are nice earbrows. Now, listen up. If you're intent to go and hook this castle, find a secret pipe near this village. I don't know where it is, but I know you need some stone keys to use that pipe. The keys are somewhere in this drunk fortress. Just pass the village to get them first. Well then, Murphy, get going and take care of the Hooktail monster. Okay, so awesome. And without, uh, I, and, and I mean now, with the uh, advice from the old man, let's go ahead and uh, hopefully see if the, oh, we got an email. I'm. 
You get an email. Okay, as you travel. Okay, this is just telling us that uh, if we travel, we can receive emails. An old strange little called a shrunk uh, fortress lives ahead. A stone creature lived there. At least it might live there. This gate is uh, just to keep it out. My job is guarding the gate. But if the mayor says it's okay, I'll let you pass. Careful out there, though. Um, excuse me? Uh, I, I beg your pardon? Uh, w w wait a moment, please. P uh, pardon me for yelling like that. I was, um, uh, I, I was panicking. Uh, how, how to begin? My, 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 my name is Coops. I, I heard you're traveling to Hooktail's castle. So, uh, anyway, I, um, I, I have a favor to ask. Um... Uh, well, um, oh, oh, just forget it. Never mind. Ignore me. Good, goodbye. Okay, that was weird. What do you think that was all about? Talk about issues. Wow, Gumbella starting to show her mean side, actually. But uh, if we head this way, the first thing that you want to do is check this bush to get another star piece. Pretty awesome. Uh, hitting the trees is going to give you nothing, as you know. I do believe, and uh, I actually think that uh, maybe after this battle, maybe it's time to cut them, because I, I do believe you guys have seen enough. Oh, never mind, we have a new enemy over here, which is, uh, now let me see if we can go ahead and uh, switch. We are going to tattle this guy. How about we do that now, and uh, that's a Koopa Troopa, they've been around forever, so you guys have seen this enemy before, so I'm not going to read his uh, tattle entry. But we can do the same thing as a previous game, which is uh, flipping them in uh, in their bellies and do major damage now that the, uh, now that their defense uh, 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 drops to zero. So let's go ahead and do it one more time. And he is done. So we get a nice five star points for that. Pretty cool to continue our adventure. So uh, to the Schwank Fortress. I really hate how they only give you like two or three coins. I mean. We, uh, they, uh, <laughs> they could have carried more, uh, more stuff with them, so, uh, we have another Koopa Troopa over here, and I actually believe this is the, uh, the, the last fight that we are going to, that, that I'm going to show, if it's, uh, okay, it's not going to take that long, so, how about we do that, and, uh, uh, let's actually concentrate our firepower on on this guy because the the, the Goomba is not going to do a scratch to us. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Actually, uh, l let me see if I can do something. Oh damn it! Okay, uh, the actually the reason why I missed that is because I was trying to do the uh, the attack action command, which uh, I will maybe have the chance to show you in a later video. But uh, what it means is that not only do you get to ignore uh, all damage that you were dealt, but you are also uh, going to inflict one damage to the enemy. Like, for example, if a Goomba, uh, if a Goomba hits you, uh, you can potentially ignore ev uh, all damage that is going to be dealt to you, and you're going to, uh, to deal one damage to him, so I don't actually know how, uh, exactly how that is called, uh, but I'm going to call it the, the attack action command, so... Well, no, the, the, attack, the attack action command would be this, so... Oh, right there you see Luigi's in the crowd. Pretty cool. Okay, so, uh, six star points, not bad. And, uh, how about we, uh... Yeah, so, not the action command, uh, star, uh, uh, attack action command, but, uh, yeah. I just wanted to put that out, and I'm going to show later whenever I get the chance to. So, I do believe this episode has been going on for quite a while, so it's time for... Uh, it's time to say goodbye. So, uh, if you guys have enjoyed the episode until now, and uh, if you wa uh, guys have watched the episode until now, and if you enjoyed, a like and a comment would be really appreciated. Favorite this video if you'd like to watch it again, and subscribe to watch more videos like this. And with anything else to say, you guys have a great day, take care of yourselves, and until the next video, I will see you then. However, I have a nice idea, which is uh, using the Fire Flower, because they are pretty cheap. So, I'm going to go ahead, and as you can see, it has the same graphics as the first Paper Mario, which is a really nice, really nice. And uh, we are going to go ahead and do a uh, head bonk. Fuck, okay.